Hello, all you space engineers out there. Commander Kingfish here, and it is day 36 here on the Frozen Rock. And we are, we've been making some progress on our coal power facility. Now, at the end of last episode, I ran into a bit of a problem where it didn't seem like the turbines or anything was working. So I was trying to do a little bit of investigating. I had gotten out of the game, then I gotten back in, and everything was working fine. So maybe it just needed a restart to kick those things off. But we'll go out and take a look at that. So today we got to start working on our uh, drilling facility and how we're going to handle that. Uh, I also got to start piping up the turbines and the boilers into the large containers out there. So I need to grab supplies to uh, pick those up and also I want to put in a uh, first aid kit out there which uh, let's see what do I need for that uh, let's just go ahead and grab that uh, let's see I'm trying to remember where it's at medical here we go uh, small medical I think it's this one and let's just go ahead and pull it down just need one yeah it's this one so let's get the parts for it oh can't withdraw medical components that's because I've got to make some so I need four four medical components uh, is that in the assembler let's see I don't remember production yes one, two, three, four. There we go. And I should have plenty of silver for that. We made that one silver run. And that should give us everything for that. We can load that up into the truck, into the cargo hauler. Alright. There we go. Let's put that in there. And uh, oh, I didn't realize I had some stone in there. Let's get that out of there. And let's start unloading all of this. Okay, we'll throw the stone over here. And the other thing we're going to need to take is a bunch of components for piping and conveyors. So we might as well start with that. Uh, let me just do it this way. Uh, this ought to work. One, two, three. And we can throw all of this stuff in there. So, that. Okay, well, while I'm getting the uh, cargo truck called and loaded up, uh, and I start make, get a few more details done around here, get this unloaded, 
I will uh, catch back up with you all uh, once I'm back out to the coal facility. Alright, I am back. I made it over here to the coal facility. So, I did grab a bunch of parts to try to, well, start filling out these concrete blocks and to put in a medical facility, which I'm probably just going to pop it in right here. Uh, one of those small medical bays. And also, I wanted to show you, you can see the uh, turbines, turbines spinning away here. Uh, and uh, they are producing energy. Let's go take a look at one of them. Actually, let's start with the coal, coal boiler. I put I put some coal into this one as well. So you can see it's got coal here. Uh, it's not really pulling anything in at the moment. But if we go over to the control panel. Uh, yeah, it's not uh, actually needing to produce any steam. But we come over here and if we look at the steam turbine uh, you can see that uh, down here under ship power it's showing okay. Uh, it says time left 13 hours so again it's not really needing to produce anything at the moment uh, because there's just uh, the other systems in place but I suspect as the night falls and that solar panel goes offline then this will probably need to be used a little bit more but we should be pretty sufficient on power uh, for for now uh, so I need to just finish get this facility finished up and then uh, we'll be off to the next project but for now let me uh, get started on this and I'll get uh, some of these blocks filled in I'll get the medical bay up and start uh, figuring out what I want to do for uh, my uh, drills and whatnot so I'll be back in a little bit Okay, I am uh, back, and as you can see, it's nighttime here. I've started putting up some lights, and I got my uh, medical uh, first aid station set up. So we're starting to make some progress here. I, I filled all of this in, so and I actually need some energy here. One thing I like about these is it's based on it's more of a medical station, so you. Uh, tank up a lot faster you get your energy back faster as opposed to just sitting in the, the seat and I could get my energy from there but this gives me the ability to heal if something bad should go wrong so now I have started trying to lay out what I want to do I think what I'm going to do is have one pipe coming down uh, since these two are connected I don't need to worry about trying to connect them both from under the bottom so I've gone down and in here so I'm gonna have uh, some sort of connection I might just have the pipe coming <clears throat> straight down from here going down and so I've tried to uh, I marked where this location was and I've also been doing some drilling out and I've marked down below down in the mine so let's go down there and take a look and this is ultimately going to be uh, stairs uh, some sort of catwalk system to get in and out of the mine down here so we'll come down here and as you can see I've started drilling and I used that as my mark and so I drilled over to here and then I've marked my bottom of my mine right here 
So, if you look up, I'm pretty well somewhat close to the bottom of that. So I think what I'm going to do is just kind of... Uh, enlarge this down here. Kind of going around. And then just kind of clearing this out. Making it fairly large. And then what I'm going to do is go up above and I'm going to drill down towards this marker right here. And then from there, that's what I'll have to do to work. Work to, to get that filled in. So what I'm... Uh, so yeah, so then I can run a, a pipe down to there and that'll connect into the base and then from here we can start creating uh, some sort of drill system that will uh, be able to mine the coal and fill up those two large bins up there and then that'll probably do it. I probably won't have to really uh, mine much more coal uh, and then plus I will uh, take out any gravel. I'll haul the gravel over to the other uh, facility and utilize the gravel over there. Alright, well once I get a little farther along and actually when I'm ready to start drilling down through there uh, I've got to devise a plan on how to drill down and also build my pipes as I'm coming down out of there because I don't have a jetpack. So I can't just fly up and down and build that out. So we'll see how that all works out here. But uh, I'm going to carve this out a little bit more down here. And then I'll be back with you once I'm ready to start drilling down to the bottom. Okay, I think I'm ready to start drilling down. I think here's what I'm going to try to do. I'm going to build the pipe as I'm drilling down. Hopefully, I'm not going to get stuck. Uh, this is uh, a bit of a dangerous operation, but I should, at, at worst case, just be able to drill down towards my mark and be able to hit that down there. Hopefully we're going to be able to drill somewhat straight down and as we're putting these pipe in. So let's do this. Let's, so there's the first pipe. And actually what I'm going to do is... Let's uh, build that, and then let's see if we can put another one in. Uh, three. Okay. All right, I'm going to go and I just want to make sure I have enough pipe to get all the way down. So I'm going to... Let's... Uh, three... Let's see if I got it in here. Uh, steel tubes are over here. <clears throat> Hopefully I've got enough. Okay. One more. All right, that replaces those two. All right, let's get back over here and start drilling down. All right. Once we do this, we're committed. All right. All right, let's get a pipe. Oh, uh, I'm not far enough 
down am I? All right, let's go down a little bit more. Uh, where's my mark? All right, let's hope that I can... Uh, let's see if we can reach this. There we go. Okay. Now let's <clears throat> build that one. All right, that one's in place. All right, let's go down a little farther. All right, let's see if we can get another one in place. Perfect. Get that built. And uh, let's get a little farther down. All right. farther here. Well, so far so good. I still got 26 feet to go and I don't know if I'm going to have enough pipe but it is what it is I'll have to figure that out down at the bottom I think I got enough for just one more pipe. Yeah. Alright, so we're going to have to drill down. Alright, we're just going to have to drill down to the mine bottom. That's all we can do. Then I'll have to figure out how to get the pipe up here. Maybe some sort of scaffolding. That was the problem with the inventory. I just didn't quite have enough. How are we doing? That looks straight down. I'll probably have to do a little bit of alignment. kind of drilling down. Okay, we're down on the bottom. Alright. Okay. 
Well, we only was able to carry about half as much pipe. All right, so once I get more pipe, uh, let me go grab more pipe, and then we'll see if we can't get down to the bottom down here. And uh, I'll catch back up with you when uh, I'm ready to finish putting the rest of that pipe in. Okay, I've got all the components, or as much as I've brought over this trip to build pipes. I'm hoping that I can get enough to, down through here. Uh, I got an idea. I think what I'm going to do is try to build scaffolding. Oh, that's not what I want. I want six. There we go. And so, let's see, we'll put that right there. We can get... One there. One there. Um, I'm gonna put one there. And then let's see if we can do this. All right. I have to drill a little bit of this out. Okay. And so can I, let's see if I can do this, six, I just need to get up to where I can reach the piping, and See how this is going to work. All right. Put that right there. All right, I got up to that one. All right, I think that might work. So let's see. All right, let's get up as high as we can. Let's go six. Wonder if we can put that right there and then we can jump over to it. All right. see if we can get another one in on this opposite side all right so we're right if we can get right about there I think a couple more And then we'll take these out as we're coming back down. All right. There, maybe? closer okay all right right 
there. Okay. And right there. All right. Well, this is working out. about there. My co-pilot Butsy the cat is looking at me like you're crazy. Alright, let's see something here. Let's just see. Oh, cool. All right, I don't think I can reach it yet to weld it. I don't think. All right, I'm gonna have to put one more block in. All right. Now let's make sure I'm all the way up here. Okay. All right. Okay, I think that's got that completely welded. All right. Okay, now let's see if we can just get our way down out of here. Three, three, let's see if we can get another one in. All right, so we can take that one out. And let's go. Okay, we can take that out. So we're probably going to have to... Go down to this one. And take that out. And control three. So we can get a, another one in. One. Okay, that's that. All right. Over to this one. And take that out. Ooh, I don't know if I can get this one in. I might have to go down one more. Yeah. All right, let's take that out. And we're starting to get close to the bottom. I still don't know if I have enough pipes. Three. Oh, you dog, you. Can't. All right. All right. We're gonna have to take that one out, I think. And then let's see if we can get the pipe in on this one.
Come on, what's blocking it? What if I squat down? Oh, am I on steel plates? Well, that's what the problem is. All right, I got to go get more pipes. All right, I'll tell you what. Let me get some more pipes. I'd like to get this all the way down to the bottom before I finish the video. So uh, I will catch back up with you in just a few minutes. All right, I am back. I think I have enough pipes now to get up. I don't know if I can get back up there now. Oh, come on. They did it the first time. There we go. Alright, and up to here. Alright, I should be able to reach that now. There we go. Yeah, if you have materials, then you can build stuff. It'll go into place. Which, actually, I needed to probably take those out anyway. Just by the looks of it. Alright, let's see if we can get this one into place. Nice, alright. There's that. Oh. I'm actually kind of happy with the way this is turning out and being able to uh, go up the side of the wall there with those uh, blocks. All right, let's get that welded up. All right. Now, I think I should be able to reach this from down here. Alright, let's take this out. And let's see if we can kind of... Come on. Alright. That's pretty good. Let's see if we can get that last pipe in down to here and get it welded up. Okay. Well, that's all connected in. We will be able to have power down here now because that's connected in up above onto the grid. So, I think the next episode... Uh, we've certainly run a little bit longer on this one, but the next episode, we're going to start building out our drilling, uh, figuring out our drilling process down here, and uh, get uh, coal moved up above. Now, I don't know if I'm going to put like a rotor on here and uh, send it down that way, but I'll figure figure that out. But let's go back up top. And we'll close out up above. I think it's daylight up there. Well, actually, I know it's getting close to daylight. Come on. Up, up, up. It was getting close to daylight uh, when I had to go. Yeah. All right. Those three enemy ships. Yeah, that's just wonderful. Uh, we should be fine, though. They should just be carrying on their way. That's just an escort. Okay, well, if you uh, enjoyed the video, please hit that thumbs up. It really helps out the video a lot. And uh, please subscribe. It really helps out the channel. Uh, trying to increase uh, subscribership. All right, well, space engineers, keep building away. And with that, Commander Kingfish is out of here. And I will see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone.